You're watching Midday Live. It's now time for us to do some business and ever imagine being paid with cassava fish or bread instead of cash, checks or credit cards. Well, our reporter Daniel Latte visited Germany, a community in the eastern region which still practices the butter trade. Germany is a rural community along the Volta Basin of the eastern region known for fishing. Its market center is sited close to the river bank. By 6 a.m. at the Bank of Germany, traders started arriving in a canoe, one after the other. In less than an hour, the square had completely been crowded by traders from surrounding communities. Children who would interrupt business transactions of their parents are left in the canoe. Seeing several produce loaded from the canoe to the market, the crew envisaged traders here would make quite reasonable sums. It did not take too long for me to realize that money was not the medium of exchange for these traders. I was confronted with the reality when I called this woman to buy some of her produce. Instead of demanding money, she asked what I had in exchange. You say you want banchi, but you come here, then you, you give it to her. Then, I realized trading in this part of the country is done by butter. It's a typical market day here at Germany, though butter trading is not the way in which we do business or trade. Today, it exists in one form or another. Interestingly, they have preferences. When I give the uh, cassava to the fish seller, she will give me fish. So when I like it, I'll give the cassava to her. This other woman was seriously bidding to exchange plantain for fish. The normal practice here is to carry items one wanted to exchange until it attracts someone's attention. But when the market is dull, the traders devise other means. This time, they rather go to people with their produce. Just as you can see, the women here are trading. They are exchanging maize for fish. First timers from adjoining cities who might want to earn cash in this market are often disappointed. <laughs> Some goods meant for butter sometimes do not get interested people with items for exchange. What these traders do not know is that the nation loses revenue when goods and services are traded by butter. However, butter trading has become a language that is all too common for these traders to forsake. Daniel Lati, TV3 News.